Okay, it's uh, April 7th, 2019, and I continue to get these little messages from God, continuing on with the message I shared earlier. And I saw a box. It was a cardboard box, but I thought of it as if it was a, like, you know, like a box that uh, a person would be laid to rest in. And inside of that box were two things. Like a silvery, shiny space blanket, you know, to keep something warm. Uh, like, then wrapped again inside of, like, a plastic. So, interestingly, uh, you know, I thought of, like, David in his old age when he became cold. Uh, he had been given, uh, like, a, like, a virgin that he never knew. But he knew, you know, he slept together with but didn't know her in that fashion she remained a virgin uh but it was to keep him warm and um curiously uh just as i was um, about to make this last message regarding that uh a person uh, was here at the park where i'm at uh wearing a jacket that said uh, like four of a kind. I believe it was like it had like a playing card on there, but it said four of a kind. Now David says in his prophecy, um, after Nathan comes to him, that man shall surely die, and he shall restore the lamb fourfold. So that is a very curious thing that God kind of set up there, but it's almost like you know maybe it's this uh, this virgin. Uh, you know, maybe the virgin lamb was sent to David to keep him warm. You know, even in death, you know, like when his body was was dying, when his seemed like all hope was lost here on earth, there was this like this virgin sent to him to keep him warm. Uh, you know, that he, you know, maybe he had to pass through the valley of the shadow of death, you know, fearing no evil. Uh rem wait waiting and and uh, waiting patiently for for the Lord to to rise him up again um, that he could bring forth these four uh, four of a kind it's almost like you know the the lamb being restored fourfold you know God knows exactly uh, the purpose of me speaking that but uh, was definitely brought to my mind. And uh, just take all things to the Lord in prayer. And look to Jesus Christ. You know, don't look to me. Uh, just, I'm, you know, I'm learning as I go. But it's, you know, where each one of us are just like a vessel. And if we allow ourselves to be used by the Holy Spirit to speak that which is true. That which the Lord God Almighty would require us to speak. You know, it's it's just that we we are to bring that forth, and it's you know it's not for our own glory, uh, but for God's glory, for for uh, Jesus Christ's story to be known throughout all the world, the gospel, the good news that through Him we can have life again, that we could be uh, raised to life and and make our way unto God and be found worthy of God, just as His Son Jesus was found worthy. So. Uh, Praise his name forevermore. God bless you in Jesus' name.